Leo Frank is buried here at Old Mount Carmel Cemetery in Glendale, Queens, the final resting place of a man whose death in Georgia exactly 100 years ago is now considered a tragic chapter in American history involving anti-Semitism and injustice in the Deep South. He was persecuted. It's as simple as that. Raised in Brooklyn, educated at Cornell and Jewish, Frank was the manager of an Atlanta pencil factory in 1913 when a 13-year-old employee, Mary Fagan, was murdered. He became a suspect after a man historians believe was the real killer pointed the finger at him. Frank was charged and convicted, a prosecution fanned by anti-Semitism and sensational press coverage. It was so prejudiced against him they didn't care. Frank was sentenced to death but given life in prison when the governor intervened. Outraged, a group of men kidnapped Frank from prison and lynched him. 15,000 people turned out at the funeral. The injustice gave rise to the Anti-Defamation League as a watchdog against anti-Semitism and hate. 100 years later, the group says the Jewish community has come a long way, but the fight for equality isn't over. We are seeing it not just in the Jewish community, but we see attacks on, on the Sikh community. We see attacks on the, within the African-American community. We see attacks within all different kinds of minority groups. On Monday, the ADL and Jewish leaders from around the city will gather at Old Mount Carmel Cemetery at 2 p.m. to mark the 100th anniversary of Frank's death. Organizers say they're hoping the service will serve as a reminder of what can happen when people make decisions based on hate. Subsequently, the state of Georgia uh, pardoned uh, Leo Frank, uh, but of course, uh, by that point, um, he, had already been, he had already been killed. But it's an important part uh, of our history and, and it's something that um, you know all of us should care very much about. Councilman Rory Lansman is encouraging the public and people of all faiths to attend. In Glendale, Rochelle Boone, New York One.